It is safe to say that Chris is the new Dick and Harry of Hollywood, and look at all of them. They are all showstoppers, amazing and popular actors, and of course, you can't take your eyes off how attractive they are. Welcome back to another Celebrities Thirsting on Another, and on today's video, we will let our celebrities talk about one of the several hotshot Chris's, Chris Pine. My favorite scene to shoot was probably another scene with Chris where um, he was just frozen, just giving me energy and support, um, but, but in silence, which is rare. But in silence. Um, the 40-year-old has been a fan favorite since his time on Star Trek and Shadow Recruit, and after a very successful performance in Wonder Woman, he is ready to hit the screen alongside Gal Gadot again. Before we jump on the list, do not forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel, because we certainly know you don't want to miss out on any of the drama. Also, don't forget to watch the video till the very end, because you know that we will be giving you a bonus laugh at the end, Gal Gadot. It is only fair to start with the Wonder Woman. Because when the Wonder Woman couldn't ignore the charm of the soldier, it is a given that no one can. Both of them shared a 10 out of 10 on-screen chemistry, and it is no surprise that some of it might even come off off-screen, too. Godot and Pine had to attend a series of interviews for their film promotion, and they seemed to be really comfortable and totally taken over by each other's presence which was amazing and beautiful and tasty. And <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling about this. It's a great adjective, right? It's tasty. It was saltier. Uh, London, however, was a little bit... Pity that Godot is married, for this could have been a couple that turned heads. Anna Kendrick. When asked about whether or not Chris Pine is the Prince Charming for Cinderella Anna Kendrick, she obviously responds with a resounding yes and goes on to talk about how much she is swooned by his presence. How much of a uh, Prince Charming is is this gentleman right here in this movie? I mean, it's I, I can barely contain myself. It's so, crazy, oh, right? Chris, there you go. stop crazy. torturing me. Oh my God, he just, you, know, you, know, you know what this does to me. Connie Nielsen. Working on Wonder Woman is a tough job. Let us stack the odds. In the words of Samir, it was an island full of women. But when the queen of that same island is totally appreciative of you, we think you have a pretty high bar. Connie Nielsen talked about how it is only possible for an understanding and talented guy like Chris to do all his scenes with such charm on the Jimmy Kimmel Live show. It, it, the beginning of the movie, it, it's nothing but women for like the first 15 minutes until Chris Pine shows up. That's right, and then ruins everything. And ruins the whole thing, <laughs> yeah. Chris show up and and be the only guy there. Only Chris could, you know, carry that off. He was unbelievable. He just, there's one scene where he is, you know, he's been captured and the, he's been wrapped in the lasso of truth. And we're all looking at him, like all 50 of us in our full gear, looking down on him as he's kneeling on the floor. And all of a sudden, Chris sort of, uh, you know, listens to me saying, what is your mission? And I'm so mad and so angry. And he kind of like just breaks character for a second. Says, is there a king I could talk to? <laughs> <laughs> Sophia Batella. The 38-year-old doesn't need a separate introduction for all the mesmerizing roles she has played on screen. But what you need is to have a look at her constant but silent flirting with Chris Pine throughout her Star Trek interviews. Bit of a blow, but both of them never confirmed their relationship status when rumors flew in 2017 that the co-stars were dating and regularly going out. When, with this one or? Yeah, with this film, yeah. Oh, I mean, yeah. I don't, I don't even think it was really a question for us. You know, we, we were excited to hear that they were going to make a third one and uh, we were all attached to it. I mean, we didn't, we couldn't have, we couldn't have said no if we wanted to. <laughs> I mean, he's a great guy and uh, brings so much of his heart and his humor to his work. And uh, he was really available to all of us and uh, supportive. Even when he wasn't shooting as an actor, he was on and in and uh, acceptance and uh, and people that are really locked down in an old way of thinking and a nationalistic, xenophobic, uh, fear-driven way. And you know, I think Lisa Lampanelli. When Lisa Lampanelli meets Chris Pine for the first time, she doesn't at all back down, saying how attractive he is and how she would like to be intimate with him. 
Not only that, she even goes on to admit that she has a crush on his dad. We do understand that going after Chris is inevitable, but the latter definitely makes the entire situation a bit weirder. Hello. You look great. How you doing? Oh, Chris Pine is so into me. Really? Wow. <laughs> is that a pine cone in your pants or are you just happy to see me? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> you have not met before. No, I have not. I'm very impressed. Thank your you father much. being the guy from Chips. Did you like him? I did. He's a handsome man. Tell me your mom was Mrs. Roper. I'll bang you right here. Zoe Saldana. Co-star Zoe Saldana is another to be added on the long list of celebrities who are taken over by Chris Pine's attractiveness. During the premiere, she moves over comparing Benedict Cumberbatch and Chris, but does go on to say how captivating his blue eyes are. And lastly, who, who's more charming, Benedict or Chris? I think they both are because Benedict, with that beautiful little English accent of his, can get whatever he wants. And Chris Pine, with those little blue eyes, it's like, oh my god, you just want to punch him. He's so adorable. So I think both of them. Imogen Potts. If you thought that Chris has his chiseled body because of the strict diets, we are here to say that you are wrong. Zoe Saldana's biggest complaint about Chris Pine is, funnily enough, that Chris eats all the time. And during the Late Late Show with James Corden, Chris Pine graciously accepts and comes to the rescue of all foodies, saying he loves to eat. But the topping on the cake is that he seems to have a really friendly sandwich date with Imogen Potts, who pulls his leg throughout the entire show. You're about to go on a summer break. Have you, what do you do on your summer break? What's a Poots summer break? Well, actually, something... <laughs> something... Something that I've got to work on is it, to do with my... <laughs> because Imogen. when I tell a story, <laughs> you're, wa the you're wasting all the salad. <laughs> Damn, it's a five second rule. Five second rule. Five second. And now for the bonus dose of laugh for you, here's Chris Pine being well, just himself. Phrase all the time, and I'm like, do people really sing well, in the it's, shower? It's the acoustics, right? <laughs> You just sound better in the shower. But right? there's but there's water coming down into your mouth. Like well, I mean it's it's like your own music video. Do you dance when you sing? And what are the songs yeah, that you sing? Yeah, you know, I mean look, you first you soap up and then you do the you know your business, then you have you know, 15, 20 minutes of singing. It's very normal. Wow, you're yeah. we have a drought in California, you know. <laughs> not, you should not be in the shower that long. <laughs> Great progressive piece of filmmaking. Oh, you're in Wonder Woman. Uh, no, I play uh, a guy named Steve Trevor, who is Wonder Woman's uh, uh, better half. Ah, but uh, there's a Mr. Wonder Woman. I didn't Mr. know Wonder that. Woman. Yeah, are they? Yeah. They're not married, though, right? I mean, I can't get into the, the finite oh. details of it, but I'm, yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm like Wonder a stay-at-home dad married. kind of guy. <laughs> wow. What is it like to play a superhero's boyfriend? You don't see that very much. I mean, it's great. Do you have uh, powers? None. Oh. <laughs> Absolutely none. Um, your microphone's still yeah. turned on. What's the best way to die? With, with, my, no. with my hard cock and my young wife. What do you want? <laughs> that's how I want to die. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like a good What do you want? <laughs> how I want to die? Yeah. <laughs> It's like, just never wake up. Adios, yeah. muchachos. Definitely don't want to get hit by a truck. No, that'd be a downer. And, and unpleasant. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, someone just was just getting their mail. Not only do A-list celebrities love Chris Pine, millions of fans who mistake him for another Chris also love him. If you loved the video, do subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon because we will be back with more videos of celebrities blushing and talking about their crushes before you know it. See you all soon.